The style mission event to be staged on Sunday at the Pegasus Pool side is geared to support comedian Henry Rodney's medical treatment as well as to source a prosthetic leg for the one-time Guyana Fashion Weekend makeup artist Corinne Gibson. The fact that in Guyana there is still the spirit of community and um, when I say that I mean that we still love each other even if you just know my father by seeing him on stage or even if you just laugh at his jokes when I walk down the street or if I'm up and about people will just stop and say listen how is your father doing and that is highly appreciated and so on behalf of my family I want to say a huge thank you for the support that all of the country has been giving. I want to say thank you again to Sonia. Um, this is just quite moving um, that you would take the time out to just do this. Tamara Rodney, daughter of comedian Henry Rodney. It is being coordinated by the Sonia Noel's Foundation for Creative Arts in collaboration with Guyana Fashion Weekend. It is quite warming to see that there are people who still relate to the human touch, the human touch to care, the human touch to say how are you doing, and the human touch to give. And so let's just be great examples in, in our neck of the woods, wherever you are. You may not be able to do a grand fundraiser, but you know, you can say hello to a neighbor, you can talk to a child on the road, you can, you know, offer a listening ear. And we had an amazing conversation a few nights ago and we talked about the importance of us to just listen and start a conversation because you could save someone's life. Richard Young, the event's artistic director, said the foundation and Guyana Fashion Weekend has always sought to move beyond just presenting fashion for the sake of having another fashion show. And as such, Style Mission has supported several causes that are most impacting. We even supported anti-suicide action in some of our projects, so we always work that way. This year, um, we are going to produce a phenomenal show. The precursor to it is what you're going to see on Sunday, Style Mission. Phenomenal show, not only because it's a 50-year anniversary, but we are allowing a lot of new designers to make a statement and to be expressive. You know, So while you're coming to support the causes, you are also empowering young people. Because they need you to endorse the fact that they are making a difference with their lives. They need you to say, yes, your style represents who we are. We need, we, we need you to make them feel that they can take up a non-traditional career path. Young further stated that though the event is focused on raising funds for medical attention, it is also a launching pad for budding designers. My function is to gel these things together, to gel the fact that we need to empower youth, we need to build creative industry and we need to always support social causes. So that's why I'm called the creative director. So um, on Sunday we're going to be also presenting um, an auction and the auction will bring attention to a visual artist, Davina de, de Poutron, who does phenomenal work and would have stayed unknown and undiscovered if we didn't choose this avenue to say, look there's a visual artist, not a girl who does paint but a person who is contributing to Guyanese style through the visual arts. We're also going to feature one of Sonia's signature pieces and a piece that is going, that was used at the Grammys by the wife of a gentleman from St. Lucia who um, was a judge at the Grammys. For Safe TV Headline News, I'm Mondale Smith.